Yes or no? Yes. So I'm sorry, I haven't filled out a resume for like 11 years. So we're practicing the Uncle Mel Craps Away 156. 156. So we're going to start with a $1,000 bankroll. Okay. I got the tray right here. So, and then we'll start with a $1,000 bankroll. I mean, then we got white. So, they're going to take out 20 from here. Okay. So basically, this is called the 156 BC that Uncle Mel created from Craps Away. For for me, on the crap table, so I kind of owe it. This is Uncle Mel's strategy, and it's basically trying to collect black chips real quick. So I'm, I'll do the betting real slow. I'll do the betting real slow. The dice has to hit though. So we'll see how it turns out. And number one. Okay, so 55, hard 10, point. Okay. I'll go slow so you can follow. Okay, so hard 10, right there. So that's a good hit. 55 hard 10. So what I'm doing is um, I'm going to drop the dollar. Okay. So the 20 pays $40. I'll make this neat. Pays 40 right here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to have them take us to 50, okay, take us to 50, on the 10, that we made it, take $5 from my rack, we got 15, 20, we're going to go to 35, okay, and this strategy is not, like Uncle Mel says, is not stay alive. This is to get to black chip level. So that's the goal. They'll come up with. Okay, hard 10. We're back on the hard 10 again. Okay. Hard 10 point. So to the point. Yeah, three rows. So I like this strategy. I'll go slow on the what we're trying to accomplish. So four two six, okay? Four two six. Four two six. Okay, so eighteen dollar oh eighteen dollar six. It pays twenty one, and that's why I like what Uncle Mel came up. It pays twenty one dollars. Okay, so over here it pays twenty one for the six. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna drop three dollars more. So 21 and 18 is 39 dollars okay 39 40 41 42 so i'm gonna have that have the dealers take me to 42 okay they're gonna take us to 42 we're gonna make them look like 42 okay double check Forty-two. 
five to seven. So the dice gotta be hitting. The dice, the dice gotta be hitting. But like I said, if we take a mulligan right now, this is fine. That way I can show the moves, right? So we got everything pressed up over here, right? So let's say, and this is only practice. We're just trying to work on the strategy. So we'll have them set us back up again, play the hand out. That way you can see the transparency and the, when the dice not hitting, when the dice is not hitting, just no strategy works, you know what I mean? So, so we're gonna have them set us back up. I'm gonna pay the hand, okay? Go to $18.68, okay? So all this comes down, all this comes down. So we're gonna pay. 156 to the house. Have them set us back up. Okay. Like I said, that, so it'd be hand number two. And this is how I play in Vegas. So I play this strategy. I don't bet. I don't bet real big, but this strategy will get me to where I'm at on the thousand dollar bank with the dice hits. So, so that'll be the first hand, second hand now. Maybe that's, I'll fight some PSOs. Okay. So 516, point is six. Okay. The dice gotta be hitting though. This strategy, the dice gotta hit. And if it's not, I walk. Okay. Heart six. Okay. Heart six. Heart six. Heart six. So, winner on the six. We're going to do the same thing. It pays $21. Okay, pays 21. I'm gonna give $3 more and have them take me to 42. Because 21 and 18 is 39. And then we go to 42. Okay, we're gonna take all this. Puck is off, come on, roll. <coughs> Fight two seven, come out. Doesn't hurt us. Come on, roll. And just out of curiosity, I'm throwing the 5142 just to see what my dice is doing. I could throw the hard wings, but Uncle Mel. So, 549. Okay. Five four nine point. So this strategy, like I said, is not to stay alive like Uncle Mel says. This is to get black chip real quick. Okay, your eleven. And this is it. Same style that I play in Vegas. Okay. 
Okay, 12. But the 156 is a real, when the dice is hitting, I'll go slow and show you why I like the 156. Like I said, the dice just got a hit. Six four ten, okay. Six four ten. So twenty dollars on the ten, okay. I'm gonna drop a dollar, okay. They're gonna pay us forty. They pay us forty, okay. Forty for the vig, okay. So what I'm gonna have them do is take me to fifty. Go to 50, take a nickel, and make my 435. Okay. Make the 435. So, trying to just collect black chips. Okay, so 516 is good. Okay. $18 pays 21. I'm gonna give three dollars. We're gonna go to 42. Okay. So I'll lay it out here. Okay. So here's my three. Pays $21. 21 and 18 is $39. Okay. 39 plus three gonna be 42 so we just have the dealers the dealer make it make the six look like 42 okay well actually we had it at 42 already i'm sorry so the six was at 42 when we originally hit it so take my three dollars back we're gonna drop a dollar for 50. sorry about that we're gonna take 50 for one Okay, we're gonna press all the way up to 90. Okay. We're gonna go to 90. Go to 90 on the six. Okay. And if the eight hits, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna go to 42. Let's see if the table is working or not. Okay, six, four, ten. Good hit. Okay, so we hit a repeater. Okay, six, four, ten. Drop two dollars. Okay. They're going to pay us a hundred. They get paid a hundred right here. Okay. So... We'll put our bankroll right here. So it started with a thousand dollar bankroll. Okay, so we're gonna rack the hundred. Actually, we're gonna go to a hundred. We'll press it to a hundred to show you how. Okay, we'll rack fifty. Okay. I just take my time with this strategy when I throw. Okay, so six one six one seven. So, like I said, the dice got a hit. The dice got a hit. I got caught many times, so I got caught many times on the press. But like I said, when it does hit. Because I'm, I'm showing the actual, how we, how I play this in Vegas. So, 
twenty dollars on the four. Okay. And then we're going twenty dollars on the ten. Okay. And number three. So it is basically three rollers. Three rollers that short rolls that I played on. I'm throwing, but I'm just gonna show the reality that yeah, I'll get caught, but all I need is one good hand. I'm one good hand. Okay, come on, roll. Yeah. Four one five. Four one five is the point. Okay. Three one four. So it's moving the other way. Three one four, same thing. Drop a dollar. Okay. We're gonna pay us forty dollars. We're gonna pay us forty for the Okay. So here's the dollar vig. Okay. So we're gonna make a four fifty. And then we're gonna try and do the same thing. Yeah. I'll go slow so you can see it and make the ten thirty five. Okay. Eighteen eighteen. Three two five winner. So that's a good hit. Okay, so hit the five. Pay fifty six. Pay fifty six. Okay. So fifty six and drop four dollars. Sixty plus forty is a hundred. Right, so we're gonna have them take us to a hundred. Okay. Have them take us to a hundred. Okay, stick. Okay, we go to a hundred right here. So we'll come out row now. You got the repeaters is the one that really makes the money on this on this strategy, because once I get to black chip level. Just gotta be able to hit those numbers. Okay. Six one seven come out. Okay, come out roll. Doesn't hurt. The set I throwing is the cross six is six two six three. Let's see if we can Catch a row. Ace deuce. Ace deuce. Aces. Okay, if I three eight is a point, point. So we got our six and an eight at eighteen dollars. So the goal is I want to get to forty two here. That way we collect the black chips. We collect the black chips.
Okay, perfect. Four, two, six. Four, two, six. So 18 pays $21. This is a real good move. Okay, pays $21. Give $3 from your rack. 18 and 21 is 39. Have them take us to 42. 42, you take, they will give you back a dollar. Okay. Three one four. Three oh three one four. Okay, so drop two dollars. We get paid a hundred. Okay, they'll pay us a hundred. So we'll have them take us to a hundred. Okay. all about getting to the black chip level that's what i like about give me a chance to get my money back when the dice hitting okay yo 11. Okay, five one six. So forty two pays fifty for one. Okay. So what I do, I go straight to ninety. Okay. Go straight to ninety, because I want to get to the black chip level where I can start collecting. It's a real good strategy. Looks like high risk. I'm not taking anything back, but I want to show you. Yeah. When the dice is hitting, how we take back our first hit. Like we did on the 10, we took back 50. Okay, three, two, five. Okay, three, two, five. And then, we, well, we hit the four twos earlier. So we made the small. So the five pays 140, okay? 140, which is a good hit. I mean, okay, so what I do on this one, I'm gonna have them give me the two black chips and make my five look like 40 again. Okay, so we're gonna take back because I took back the first hit, so we up 250. Okay. Six two eight. Okay, that's another one. We got. We still got them at eighteen. Okay, so that pays 21. Gonna give $3. They give me back change. And we're gonna have them take us to 42. Okay. Go to $42. Okay. Oh, sorry. Go to 42. Okay. 
four, three, seven. So, yeah, the seven going, it will come, but we still didn't lose. We took back 250 with the four and the five. So, I still made 100, okay? Here's my 156 I'm, I'm going to go back out with. So, we're going to have them set us up again, okay? It's eighteen dollars six eight. Eighteen dollars six eight. Okay, forty dollars, and then twenties, twenty dollar on the four and the ten, and that's the one fifty six. Okay. Okay. So we had them press, but we just didn't get over the hump. You know what I mean? So we're gonna pay the house to set us back up again. Okay. Come out, roll. Hand number um, four. Okay. Hand number four. Six to eight. Point is eight. Okay. Six to eight. And right now, since I PSO, you know, I, I made a hundred, but I'm trying to get back in the positive, so. We'll see if the table works with us. Okay, you owe 11. Uncle Mel calls that rubbish numbers. Because we're not on it. Wait, that's so. Oh, splash my chips. 516. Okay. Oh, oh, point is 8. Yeah. So 6 is, uh, we're going to drop $3. 20, it pays 21. Pays $21. And I go real slow. You know, somebody said I went a little too fast, but I won't go it pays 21 18 and 21 is 39 plus three dollars is 42. so we're gonna have the dealer take us to 42 dollars If I'm off on the point, forgive me. Can I just work on the strategy? Uncle Mel's. I owe it all to uh, Uncle Mel with crap so I... Okay, 415. So that's a good hit. So that we can make the move already. So we're going to drop... We're going to drop $4 out of here. Pays 56 Okay, 40 pays 56. Pays 56. So we're gonna drop $4, go to 60 plus 40 is 100. So they're gonna take us straight up to 100. Okay, straight to 100. Go to 100. The 156 black chip BC is Uncle Mel's strategy. So, the 
the dice got a hit for this strategy to work. Okay, five, three, eight, winner. Came back the winner. Okay. So again, you're gonna give three dollars, you know, to pay out twenty-one, and then take us to forty-two. Okay. Go to forty-two dollars. So right now our six and that eight is at forty-two. That was the point. Okay, come on, bro. I left a mark it though. Hang on, that may be six. Okay, hard six. Point this hard six. I'll mark them right here, okay? Hard six. So I don't want to make the video too long, so I'm just kind of going through the moves slowly, or more, much more slower. That way you can see how I get to black chip level. Aces. Okay. Five one six winner. Okay. So this is a winner. Forty two pays fifty for one. Okay. So we're gonna go to ninety. Okay. Go to ninety. Get to the black chip level. Like I said, it's a strong press, but there is reward on it if the dice turns and hits. One of the v somebody said to go a little slower, so I'm going a little bit slower on the bed. I'll show you the moves. Okay. Point is nine. Okay. Point is nine. Five three eight. So that's a good hit. Forty two pays fifty four one. Okay. Fifty four one. Ugh. Cold up here. Fifty four one. No. Fifty four one. We're gonna go to ninety. Okay. So we got a hundred and five pay hundred hundred and five payout on the six and the eight. And all the dice, we just have to have that dice hidden. No strategy works and we got short rows. Okay, 12. I'm trying to work on my throw too. So, betting and throwing, because this is what I play when I'm throwing. Okay, three, one, four. So now this is a good hit because I can show you the move. Okay. So you're gonna drop a dollar. Okay, get five dollars ready, but we're gonna drop a dollar. Pays forty dollars. Okay. 
And all you're gonna tell the dealer to make your five, I mean your four look like 50. Yeah, oh wait, there's the 40. Wait, I have too much on there. So, here's the 40. Now you're gonna tell the dealer to make your five look, your four look like 50, okay? Now you take a, you take a five, you take one red chip out of your rack to make it 15 and 20 is 35 and have the dealer put you out, uh, make your 10 look like 35, okay? Okay, 639 winner. So that's a good hit because that's $40. We're gonna drop $4, okay? And we're gonna have the dealer take us straight to 100. Okay, we go straight to 100. Okay, so dice, that's a come up roll. And I'll upload more more practice sessions on my YouTube channel too. So Okay, four two six point. So mark it down here. Okay, fifteen rows. Out of the fifteen rows for me to get to um my five and my nine to a hundred each. I also threw a lot of uh, what Uncle Mel calls rubbish numbers. So I had come out, come out numbers. I had, I mean, come out sevens. I had four numbers. So if you can see that, the numbers that I that kind of that hit that I pressed was basically the four, five, six, nine, and eight. So that's where it set me up. So right now we're just looking to hit now. And I'll show you if it does hit. Okay, perf oh, four, three, four, three, seven. So I never get to show you. But if the dice did hit, let's say the dice did hit the five, okay? They're gonna pay us. That way I can show you the moves. They're gonna pay us 140. Okay. I had success my last two days this past week in Las Vegas playing this because the dice was hitting. They're gonna put they're gonna pay us 140. So we're gonna take back two blacks, have them make us look, make the five look like 40 again. Same thing. Same thing if the nine hits. It's going to pay the same amount, 140. Okay. If the nine hits, let's say the nine does hit. So it pays 140. I'm going to have the dealer give me the two blacks. Okay. So that will put us at 400. Okay. Make it look like 40. Now, I got my 156 back. That's when. This strategy will only work when the dice is hitting. Like I said, if I throw on seven right now, because on this last one, I wouldn't have collected anything because I had everything set up. I had my four at 50 to collect 100. I got my six and my eight at 90 to collect 105. I had 100, 100. So I had roughly about four, give or take about four or 500. If the dice did hit, I would take back roughly. I would come down on my bets on the next one when I go to 100. If the 6 and the 8 hits at 90, okay, my press from 90 is going to be 180. 
because 180 on the six and the eight pays 210. So I'll collect the 210 off the six and the eight, okay? So if the 210 does hit again, all I do is take $30 out from my rack. And then I'm going to go have the dealer take me straight to 420. So it's basically, we're going to go to three. Let's see. It'll be, four, we're going to go to 420 because I'll go to 180 after. When 180 hits, pays 210. It'll pay me 210. 210 right here. Okay. So out of my rack, I'm gonna give the dealer, I'm gonna give the dealer $30 at 180, and I'm gonna go straight to 420. Okay. I'm gonna go to 420. Because when the six hit now. At 420, I'm gonna drop ten dollars and they're gonna pay me five hundred. So, like I said, when the dice is hitting, you got a chance to make your money back. And tonight I'm not really concentrating, so on my throws, I point seven out, I never collect anything on that row, so I would have lost 156. But the opportunity is there to, to go up. That's why from $18, from $18, I go straight to 42 because 42 will set me up to get to 90. You can go to 30, you can go to 30, but that's gonna be actually two more hits you gotta take and the seven will come. The seven is there. So I'm just trying to eliminate as many hits as I can to get my black chips in my rack. So with Uncle Mel, I owe Uncle Mel from Craps Hawaii a big thank you for coming up with this strategy for me because I was battling at Orleans Hotel. I was at, I played every single strategy. I played a 255, I played a 204 across, played a 130, a low special inside, nothing was hitting so I would actually, he, he saw me battling and Uncle Mel was gracious enough to come up with this strategy on the table while I was playing next to Uncle Mel so that I could take hits when collecting um, 200 at a time, or 100 at a time, 200 at a time. And it kind of paid off when I did catch a good roll. I caught a good hand at Golden Nugget that I made 4,500. So this 156 investment, yes, it looks like a big bet, but high risk, high re high risk, high return when it does hit because you will collect your black chips. Once you get your four up to 50, you go to 100, you can collect 200. You get your set, you get your 10 at 35, 35 with the VIG pay 70. 70 and 30 is 100, so that's another black chip. And your 5 and your 9 at 40, you drop $4, you'll be right at 100. So basically, you, if it hits, we're roughly at 600. Mm, I give or take 620 across. What I did was I brought all my 620 down. I had the dealers push me all down, bring me all down, bring me all down. And I took out of my rack 156 again. I had that in my hand. I had that in my hand, so they didn't have to. I didn't have to wait for the sh slow the shooter down. They bring this all back to me, and I would start all over again and take back 700. So I was in the game for nothing. So they'll set me back up up here 156, and I was good. So. I hope that explains a little slower from one of our subs my subscribers that said it went a little too fast. I know that other video was a little too fast, but I hope this helped you. I'll talk to you later. Aloha.